Good to see you. Hello. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Hi, nice How are you doing? I'm, I'm good. I'm super excited. I'm good. You're, you're, oh, you're good. You're, uh, you're freezing up a little bit on me. So okay. if, if, okay. What do you want to ask me about? My dad. I, I keep feeling like I keep seeing two cardinals. And I don't know if my dad and my, like, I always feel like my dad and my grandma are like my guardian mm -hmm. angels. And so mm -hmm. um, I don't know if they're trying to tell me yeah. something. Uh, there's a lot of changes mm -hmm. happening in my life right now. And I just don't yeah. know. Your dad, your dad is doing this, um, but I don't feel like he's just referencing a ring. I think he's actually talking about a marriage or a separation. Do you know if there's a change happening with the relationship? Because he's bringing this up. I'm going through a divorce right now. Okay, he's aware of the divorce, so he's just acknowledging that. So he's making reference to this. Is this the second attempt at this, or was this the second try at this? Yeah, second. Got it. He's aware. So he's acknowledging that he knows what's going on. He also says that he made your phone alarm go off or your alarm system go off because he says he was trying to get your attention. Did you have that happen? A uh, couple of times, yeah. My phone just okay. go, goes crazy, and I, I'm not sure what that is. That's your dad. So he says he's been tripping your alarm to get your attention. So he's making reference to that. He also keeps saying, thank you. Um, is there also a, a ca Carmen or Car Car Carolita or Carmenita? It's almost like he's saying it that way. Karina. Who, who is that? My sister. Okay. He's probably just trying to acknowledge your sister because he said Caro. So did y'all you, you call her Caro or Cari? Cari? Um, we just call her Karina. That's okay. He's just acknowledging your sister. He's making reference to that. There's a baby there as well. Do you know she lost a, she lost a baby? There's a miscarriage loss of termination because he's acknowledging the baby. She just found out she's pregnant. Oh, perfect. He knows about the baby with your sister. So he's just acknowledging that he knows about the baby coming in. He also, he's putting his name in the hat. So I, it might actually be a boy because he's almost wanting to put his name in the hat. And he's like, you know, no pressure, no pressure. So he's like messing with y'all. Um, he also keeps, thank you. He also keeps acknowledging, uh, he has, thank you. He just says San, Santos or San, Santiago or Santos as well. Is there a Santos or Santiago name on the different side of the family? Actually, you know what? Your ex, well, now assumed to be your ex. Is there a Santiago or Santos on that side of the, on his side of the family? Not that I'm aware of now. I, I married oh. a white boy. <laughs> That's okay. There's a Santos or San, there's a San, S-A-N name that they're wanting to make reference to. And it feels like it's on a different side of the family. So it's either in an in-law side of the family or it's like in a different side of your dad and it's not on your dad's side and it's on your mom's side. Is there a Santiago or Santo Santini on your mom's side of the family? Mm, that doesn't sound familiar now. That's okay. I'll leave that there. But there's a reference to this. Huh? This individual got shot. This is a younger person. I don't even know if this is family or not, but I feel like this person got shot. My brother-in-law. My brother-in-law died when he was 25. Okay. He got Did, shot. Well, he got shot? Okay. What's the His Santos? His name is Bautista. Bautista. Mm -hmm. Nelson. Ivan. No. I don't know. No, that's not the son. Now, I also had a cousin that died. Um, but that's... Mm -mm. This this might be the brother-in-law, but I'm trying to figure out where that Santos connection is. Because if that's not his name, I'm trying to figure out why he's trying to give me the name. Um, did he also have a little bit of a scar or mark right next to his lip? My brother-in-law. Yeah, this is your brother-in-law. So your brother-in-law is coming through. That Santos thing, I don't know either San, San, like Santos is connected, the name Santos. Do you know who was involved in his passing? Do you know that the people who were involved in his passing? They, it's still an unsolved murder. Okay, You're, this might be where this is coming in. So he might be acknowledging the Santos name or San sounding name that may be connected because he's making reference to it. He's saying four people. Do you know there were four people involved in his passing? Um, they never, uh, it was one person that shot him, but they don't know. Um, the situation? Now, we, we suspect that one of his friends um, mm. had to, something to do with it, but we never were able to. That's okay. He showed me four. So there might, have be, there might be four people who know what happened or four people who were involved because he showed me that number four is being significant. I'm asking him about the friend. He says, not that friend. Do y'all know of another friend that may have actually been connected to it? I'm not aware. My ex-husband yeah. would know. It's my, yeah, it's my ex-husband. Right. No worries. I'll leave that with you. But there's a reference to another friend. So there's an acknowledgement there. Um, there's also a Georgie or George or Jorge name connection also. 
I'll have to ask my bro uh, my ex husband. Okay, so I'll leave that with you as well. Um, I also think your your father's popping back in. So he, the guy just wanted to say hi and that he was okay and that he was at peace, so that people don't worry about him. So that's all he was trying to make reference to. So he's just acknowledging that. Going back to your father, um, your father is acknowledging he is very proud of you for standing up for yourself. He also says, don't let anyone treat you like garbage. He says, I don't care who hears me. He says, I don't want anyone treating you like crap. So he's making that very clear. He also keeps acknowledging a necklace. Do y'all have a necklace that belongs to your father? I'm wearing it. Perfect. He knows that you've got his necklace on. So he's acknowledging that. He also keeps acknowledging, thank you. Did you know someone wanted to get a tattoo or something on their back? I just got it. Last Perfect. Year. Perfect. He just acknowledges the tattoo in your back as well. So he's making reference to that as well. Um, he also, there's a little dog or there's a dog that might've been like Louie or Lou or there's like a small dog Millie. that's also- Millie? Could be, could, that could be Millie. Is, is that like a little terrier or a little like smaller dog? It's a little teacup chihuahua. Perfect. He's it just was, acknowledging- It was his, it was his pet. Yeah, and he's he, just- He died. Yeah. So he's acknowledging that the dog is with him as well. He's making reference to that. He also says, thank you. he says to tell your mom, it's funny, he's bringing up your mom. Um, has she not been able to get past this? Because he's almost acknowledging that this just kind of broke her and she just hasn't been the same since this. Do you understand that? Okay. He says to tell her that he does not want her to let her, he does not want her to live the rest of her life like this that she needs to make the most out of it because there's grandbabies coming in and she needs to live for the grandbabies. So he says for her to have the best time that she can have. He also says she needs to stop. Thank you. There's something going on with her leg that she may not be talking about, but there's something that's happening with her leg where she might need to follow up with the doctor because it might be her sciatic, nerve, her sciatic nerve that's kicking up. And he says that she needs to follow up with the doctor because it may actually be something going on in her lower back as well. She may not have told y'all, but y'all... She does. She okay. Has she has osteoporosis and she's been um, complaining about her back okay she needs to go to the doctor because there's more going on there than she's wanting to acknowledge or make or, or be aware of okay so i he's so I, i'm assuming he's happy that i'm going through this divorce because it was kind of sloppy he's like are you happy so it's like he's not answering he's like are you happy um so he's just acknowledging that he's okay um it is your ultimately your decision but he just wants you to know that he is with you and that he supports your decision. Oh God, I miss him so much. He's with you, sweetheart. He's with you. And tell him I love him. <laughs> oh yeah, he loves you, sweetheart. He loves you. Look out for that alarm kicking off because that's him. Okay. All right, sweetheart. Take Thank care. Thank you so much. Thank You're you. You're welcome. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. Oh my God.